Erica Mina is known for her out-of-control behavior, but the Bronx native says there's a reason why she's always so aggressive. Life for the reality star hasn't been easy since the day she was born. If you're new to our channel, be sure to subscribe and hit the bell to receive notifications. Here's the truth about her sad life. In a 2014 interview with Vlad TV, Erica revealed her mom was pregnant with her when she got arrested in a drug sting. Erica was born in jail, and because her mom was still finishing her sentence, Erica was placed into foster care. She told Vlad TV the first time she was abused, she was so young. I was a baby. A baby? I was like still on a high chair. <laughs> really? Yeah. So what, two, three years old? Mm -hmm. Her mom was released from jail when Erica was five, but the trauma she suffered stuck with her and only got worse. As a teen, she met Raul, an actor, music director, and Fat Joe's right-hand man. Raul was in his 30s when he began dating 16-year-old Erica. And the reality star said once she opened up to him about the past abuse she suffered, their relationship turned violent. At first, I saw it as like, oh, he loves me. And then, it became more than that. At the 2013 Face My Abuse event in Brooklyn, Erica blamed Raul for turning her into a monster. She said she would always love him, but she was sad and they could never have a friendly co-parenting relationship. At the age of 18, Erica found out she was pregnant with her son, King. She and her baby daddy, Raul, were living in Los Angeles at the time, and the alleged physical abuse was getting worse and worse. In a 2014 interview with Vlad TV, she said she had fallen down a flight of stairs and was bleeding. Instead of making sure she and their unborn baby were okay, Raul hopped on a plane to Russia and left her by herself. Thankfully, she went on to have a healthy pregnancy. Erica explained the infamous video where she kicked Raul in the neck outside of a Hollywood nightclub. She said that was the moment that she had had enough of his abuse. The video was a blessing because Mona Scott Young of Love & Hip Hop saw the footage and invited her to be on the show. But the video was also a curse because it's a painful reminder of her past. She and Bow Wow started dating in 2014 and got engaged that same year. By the time late 2015 rolled around, Erica had gone through a miscarriage and the couple eventually split. She spoke to Global Grind about their failed relationship and even called the rapper, quote, an abuser. She explained that it wasn't physical abuse. Instead, Bao allegedly played mind games with her. In October 2018, Erica found herself in yet another abusive relationship when she and her ex, Cliff Dixon, were both arrested on domestic violence charges. she moved on and got engaged to fellow love and hip hop star Safari. We really hope Erica has finally found her happily ever after. Despite everything she has gone through, Erica is proud of what she has accomplished. She went from being a video vixen to making a name for herself on reality TV. By the age of 26, she already owned a house in Florida, was taking care of her mom and sisters, and was able to send her son to one of the top schools. We're rooting for Erica and we wish her nothing but the best. What do you think about Erica's life story? Leave your answer down below. And thanks for watching Real Reality Gossip.